But this is a Max KDI here of another Dell Optiplex 9020. This is the mini tower. And I'm upgrading this, the processor right here. We're going to be upgrading from i5 to i7 4770. So what you need is a Phillips screwdriver. You're going to remove the side panel cover. Then what you're going to need is a thermal compound, Phillips screwdriver, and a, and a clean paper towel. So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, you're gonna disconnect the clip right here. The four pin is going for the the heatsink fan cooler right here. It's a four pin connector for a wire right here. Disconnect that and it has a secure clip right here. Be really gentle. You press it down, release the lock, secure lock right here. Press it down and it comes right out. So let's go ahead and get this unscrewed here. And this will work with the DT version and the MT version. The MT version is the mini tower. The DT is a slimline desktop and they're using the, uh, the same motherboard so get that removed now try to clean off the thermal compound on the heatsink cooler it's all aluminum it looks like just get that removed paper towel So I got that removed now. I'm gonna remove the processor. What you're gonna do is uh, there's a secure clip right here on the right side. Gently press it down very gently and move it to the left. Then the socket is gonna come right out. The C processor right here, the socket clip come to you really lift it up. Now you're gonna remove the processor. Be really gently. I recommend wearing gloves and uh, now. I'm gonna put the new i7-4770 in here. i7, let me get this zoomed in. 4770, 3.4 GHz quad core. Okay, now I'm gonna install it. And uh, see the edges on the top? That's the way it's supposed to go on top of it. So I'm gonna take this. Let me get this camera focused then. Okay, now I'm gonna take this and uh, be really gentle. You wanna press on a uh, on the socket. Just comes okay. Just goes right in. Now I'll put it back in. The cl clip it back in really gently. Now we're gonna apply the thermal compound. Okay. And I got this little. I'll show you guys. See this from the right here, the little plastic right here. I cut this out from the memory uh, cover, plastic memory cover you buy in the retail version. You cut off the top. I'll show you too right here. See that? Like this, you cut this from the memory right here on the top, and it works fine to for the to apply the thermal compound. Now I'm gonna don't put too much in it, just for a little in the middle, because when when you apply the uh, the heat sink on here, it will basically will spread out evenly. That's good enough. Just put it in the metal, then when you apply the heatsink fan cooler, you'll spread evenly. Just like that, perfectly fine. Now, you're going to reapply the, make sure you clean off the, the heatsink, the backside with the clean paper towel. Clean up the old thermal compound. Now, I'm gonna install back the heatsink cooler fan and use a screwdriver, Phillips screwdriver. Uh, you screw it back on, so it should be tight, so you can you actually can't turn anymore. So that means there, it's 
I mean it's secured. Now we're gonna connect the four pin, four wire connector back to the motherboard. So yeah, this this is this end of the video, guys. This is for Dell Optiplex 9020 Mini Tower. How to upgrade the processor from i5 upgrade to i7 4770. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.